Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, to my channel, to my channel. Today I'm just kind of feeling trendy. I'm bringing you a very cute trend. Yes, I changed my hair. I mean, don't ask. I kind of did a mini DIY thing-ish kind of thing going on. It's okay because we move. DIYs win. Um, so, I know you're thinking, this shirt she's wearing is loud. It is, I know, I know. But, it ties in very well, okay, of course I'm saying tie in, ha! Huh? It ties in very well with the title of this video. And it's a how I style the trend tie dye. You've probably seen tie dyes like everywhere. Literally, it's coming back. Um, I remember the first time, I think the first time I came across tie-dye was like in reception. I do like a, I think it was like a white top or something. Was it in reception? Mm, I can't remember. <laughs> this whole video is so nostalgic and it just shows you how certain trends come back um, and we just bring it to life and put a different spin to it depending on obviously the year, the century and so on. Um, so this is kind of my take on tie-dye, uh, the current trend and how I wear it. Um, hopefully you guys are inspired by some of these and are not afraid to try the tie-dye trend because I'm sure there's at least one of these looks that's out there for one of you. This orange jumper. Um, so it's got kind of like these diamond, diamante looking star things on the chest and this River Island jean, it's also got some diamante stuff on the waist and I just thought I'd pair them together because the orange goes beautifully with this wash of denim and yeah, like diamond on diamond. Um, I suppose this is kind of like a more relaxed, very casual way to wear the tie-dye. Um, I think most of these outfits are casual anyway, kind of-ish. Um, because that's just like my personal style. <laughs> yeah. I suppose it's like a brighter version, a menelin feel really rich orange. Um, this is actually from ASOS. Um, and you'll notice that these tie-dye patterns are all very, very different. So there's a little bit in there for everyone. Um, this is actually in a oversized, I think it's an oversized feel, but I got it in a bigger size anyway. I got it in a medium. Um, just to give me that, honestly, the hair is just, it's the ghetto right now. It's a medium and it's like extra, extra oversized. You know, we like oversized around these bits. So, oversized it is. Yeah. It's comfortable, you can wear it with a um, nice pair of heels if you're feeling like that. Um, or some white trainers, just something clean. It just makes sense. It just makes sense. Look too. This is loud. It's giving me summer tropics. Um, it's this top. It's like a tropical, tropical print on it. Um, I love the you know yellow details on the neckline and the arm. And then you slap on this tie dye denim jacket. Um, I just didn't try to add. Not necessarily add, but try and just match the colorways that the jacket was already giving me. So this top went beautifully with it. And I just paired it with these Armani denim jeans. I got this a while ago, but just like a lighter wash pair of jeans. So I suppose I would call this like tie dye jacket. I would actually do this maybe with just a plain white t-shirt or like a plain white crop top and some shorts or a plain white crop top and um, denim jeans even be ripped jeans, however you want to pair it, but just a nice jacket, simple white top, jeans. But I thought this top, when I saw it on ASOS, I thought, yeah, this rocking, banging with the jacket. Hello, break it, come on. Just, come on. Number three has to be this lovely, it's like a burnt burgundy. Is that a thing? I think I just created a new color. Burnt burgundy. Burgundy. Um, it's like a long line top. I think I actually got it in a size. Why is the car so loud outside? I think I got it in a size medium. Um, did I? I 
think it's a size medium. It's, it's a size bigger than what it is anyway. So it's a little longer on me and I just slap some denim shorts with this, white trainers, put on your glasses, you're going to a barbecue, hun. You're going to a barbecue. Yeah, that's it. Just a casual one. This is just barbecue vibes, just chilling. And not even like barbecue that has like your crush, not your mind crush Monday barbecue. This is just like one of your girls or like family. Like just, just a very chill barbecue, not a lot of people. Just chilling, vibes in. Yeah, cocktails here and there. It's a light one. This is a very, very casual one. The top is baggy, the bottom is tight or short. Number four is this sexy, sexy, oh, I love, love. Okay, let me tell you the story about this silk, what would you call it, like a silk kimono? This silk kimono, I saw it like a couple of, maybe like a month ago, and I wanted to get it so bad with the matching shorts and the crop top version or bralette. Couldn't find it, it was sold out, so I was just like, cool, put it in the basket and put like, on ASOS you can like put alerts for when it comes back on. So I saw the bralette, then I was just looking for the kimono. I found the kimono, guys, but I couldn't find the shorts, but we moved anyway. So I ordered the kimono. This is like tie-dye heaven. It's just incorporating sports, giving that Adidas vibe and just plain old sexy. Excuse me? Huh? Do you see this? Where, girl? You, you need this. So I just paired this with some grey leggings and obviously the sports bra that comes with the kimono and obviously the kimono. This is just chilling at home. Just, oh, just a vibe, just chilling. Or you might just have someone over, you're just in the garden, sunbathing, just relaxing, get yourself a glass of wine or a cocktail. Honey, summer is here. Do not stress yourself. So this is a very chilled way to wear tie-dye. Very, very nice, very sexy, very just, and very light. It just gives me like brightness, just illuminating. Wow, look at me. I'm in love with it. <laughs> Pathetic. I love the length. It's not too short. It's just long enough. If you really just wanted to wear it like at home, just chilling on the sofa, you could do that. You can wear it as a nightgown if you want, or you can wear it out. You can actually do this kimono with a white top and some shorts. White top and shorts. It's just a classic, it works for everything. Hello, hi. <laughs> the last but not least, you know I had to get some sweats in there. These are, um, it's, a, it's a sweat co-ward. Um, it's giving me nude, brown, earthy tones. I love that the tie-dye can kind of incorporate in that whole like, you know, just that chill vibe, swagger, that tomboy feel, you know, that's what I go for all the time, anywhere, most of the time. Um, and sweats are pretty much our uniform over on this side. So, um, you know, I had to incorporate that, obviously. This is a t-shirt though, and this is Reebok. This is from ASOS as well. And I must say the fit, perfect, perfect. The length of the top is actually um, a male uh, cohort but the length of the top fits right, the shape of the top is correct, um, and the joggers, I believe I got them in a medium, so they could just be a little bit more baggy. I didn't want that tapered look, so I wanted it to be, you know, a bit more baggy, a bit more oversized, so that's why I went for that. Um, and I think together, it's just beautiful. White pair of trainers, you're good to go, baby. You're good to go, don't even fuss. Don't even, don't cap yourself, okay? Don't cap yourself now. Uh -huh. Yes, so that's it guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. I know I did and I suppose I should also say this shirt is from ASOS. Um, I believe they are still selling it. I will put the link down below if it's still available and not out of stock yet. But let me know how you're finding the tie-dye trend. If you're trying any, please tag me. Let me know. Tag me on Instagram at Keyshographer. Um, I'm also on Twitter at Keyshographer and Snapchat at Keyshographer. Make sure you connect with me, guys. And make sure you subscribe. Subscribe. Turn on your post notifications. Make sure you like this video. Put a crazy comment down there. By crazy, I mean obviously um 
I like I said, I really want to get to know you guys and um, really grow our relationship, you know. And if you have any suggestions on any videos you would like to see, um, a lot of people are talking about doing like a Q&A or like a get to know me thing. Um, I might do that. I also want to work on some new collaborations, so we'll see how that goes. If you have any um, any YouTubers, um, any Instagrammers, any like creatives, fashionistas, or just like people you want me to collab with or you want me to get on my channel and you want us to do something crazy, just let me know. Put that in the comments. Make that um, suggestion to me and we'll get it done for you. It's summertime, guys. It's time to play, gotta have fun. Love you guys. <laughs> Bye.